you are going to be receiving a very important phone call this week and it's a conversation that has been a long time coming you have felt this in your intuition you have felt this in your heart you and this person have been communicating with each other telepathically you may have been hearing songs that remind you of them or like your guys' special songs that have a very significant meaning to you but when this person hears songs about you their heart lights up and they're immediately drawn to positive memories whatever energy this is it's something positive this is somebody they want to call you and hear your voice it feels like you haven't spoken in what feels like a long time now even if you guys spoke yesterday, this is for somebody who just feels like uh, it's been forever since we have spoken. And it seems like both of you are aware that the last time you spoke, somebody was holding back feelings. Probably both of you. Like both of you may have been waiting for the other one to, you know, confess something or waiting for the other one to come forward. But we do have this twin flame card coming out in this specific reading. And it does say mirroring and shared feelings so in these twin flame connections if we're going to use that label now don't label this you know don't use that as something to get you stuck on somebody who just isn't for you or isn't treating you right or there's any sort of abuse but we're going to use this card in this reading to mean like they're perfectly reflecting your inner world so the energy that you put out or your subconscious beliefs about them and about the situation in general like if there's some sort of low self-worth or low self-concept or like a fear of getting cheated on, it seems like those things will eventually manifest to be mirrored back to you. So there may have been some fears that manifest in the past, but it doesn't seem like anything too bad in this specific situation. But whoever this person is, the phone call is coming through this week. Feathers are going to be significant and rainbows. Rainbows like, you're the sunshine after the rain. But like, you know, it has to rain in order to get a beautiful rainbow. So something is being let go. Somebody is going to show up with flowers and along with those flowers, they want to communicate. They have words this time. I should have expressed myself better. So having this step back from each other has really given you both a different perspective, like a better bird's eye, a bird's eye view of the future and really of what the problem was. Sometimes people are not aware of their problems when they're sitting right in the middle of it. And this person seems like they weren't aware of the problem, okay? So what do we have coming in? What do we have coming in in love for this connection? What do we have in love coming in for this connection? I'm hearing you have a right to be strong. Look, projections. You and this person are mirroring this energy back to each other. Look at the orange, the blue. We have the throat chakra of communication, okay? So we do see multiple signs of communication coming in. So you and this person are going to clear some air. And it feels like some of the things that you're going to clear up with each other are just total miscommunications. And when you both stop and slow down and see where the other person was coming from, you're both able to be like, oh my gosh. Well, now I understand, but do you understand where I'm coming from? And you're both just understanding a lot on a whole different level. It's like there are missing pieces that are now coming into place. It's like we were searching for these pieces. We lifted up the couch, we looked under the table, and we just could not find these pieces anywhere. But now, this week specifically, this week, we will be finding the pieces. We will be picking up the pieces. The communication that was supposed to happen before is coming through. This person was holding back. But look, here's another rainbow. Another card that has a rainbow. I didn't even notice that. This card says adventure. And I love when there's a, a child on the image because it represents, you know, children are very forgiving. They're very loving. They're very forgiving. They want to work things out. They want to talk. She's smiling. I want to call and hear your voice. Four, four, four. Fours are all about physical manifestations, meaning I want to call and hear your voice in the physical, in the 3D. Let's make this happen. Let's make it happen. 
Maybe you guys want to go to a concert together, some sort of show, live music. I see people smiling and having a good time. Somebody might be on TV. I got that. That's not going to resonate for everybody, obviously, but you, maybe both of you guys are on TV. You and the specific per Well, there's the rebel who is the emperor who, you know, it, it's showing up as a star. Somebody may be a star. Uh, just a side message. Or somebody is working their way up towards stardom. You guys might be some sort of balance, like duo, balancing act, duo act. Anyway, back to this. We have divine masculine energy coming in. But this divine masculine energy is like, they're protective. They're a little controlling. They do want to be the boss, but they do want to do what's right. This is somebody who, and every emperor has to be like this, right? In order to become that emperor status, I have to make mistakes and also learn from those mistakes. So this is somebody who has taken the time and is going to be taking the time to think about what they've done. They're really sitting here. For a while, it's been cloudy. For a while, it's been cloudy. Like they may have had a lot going on in their life. They may be feeling stuck. They may be feeling trapped, but it does look like they are gonna come out on top. Let's get some angel messages. Let's get some angel messages. If you are still here during this reading, please like this video. Comment 222 down below if this is resonating with you. Subscribe if you haven't done so yet. Every single interaction helps my channel grow. And make sure you're following me on Instagram. I do live readings there. And you can book a live Zoom session with me. I have written readings. I have yearly readings. There's so many different options. Just check out the link in my description and everything will be available down there. Okay. So let's see what your angels have to say about this connection. What do your angels have to say about this connection? <laughs> Let go of control issues, pay attention to the red flags, and love yourself first, okay? Let go of control issues, pay attention to the red flags, and love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. So we do not want to get involved in this runner-chaser vibe, okay? And we definitely need to focus on what are these red flags, because we are getting some red flags. Spirit, can you tell me what these red flags are? The signs are cautioning you. So you might be trying to control the situation so much, much that you're missing a red flag. Tell me about this red flag that the collective is missing that you do have a choice. Sometimes you may be acting like you don't have a choice. Like, well, if I don't do it, they won't do it. Like they will. You just sometimes have to be patient. What I'm seeing here is the red flag that you're missing is you take on a lot of the emotional load and a lot of the emotional work. Like sometimes it seems like, and you guys have kind of sunken into this dynamic of you being like, I got this. I can do it all. It kind of feels like you're this emperor energy. Now that we have the queen of wands too, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy doesn't have to be your energy. We also have Gemini energy, but this is talking about you're so powerful and you're so used to taking on everything by yourself that you just naturally take on their struggles and the struggles of the people around you and the people that you care about. But while that is kind and nice, you may be depleting yourself. So really, the red flag is you depleting yourself, you over giving, you not choosing yourself before you choose this connection. That's the biggest red flag that's coming through here is we have to, there's three, oh look, another angel, right when I was gonna stop and say that, angels, we have Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, Archangel Gabriel coming in to clear the throat chakra for communication. So you can communicate clearly, just also not even, what does communicate clearly mean? So that you can have strength and power to just say, I don't wanna go there, I do wanna go there. And just, it's sometimes a lot of it's boundaries for ourself. Like when we're in a relationship, we're so in love and we wanna spend all our time together, but it's not always the healthiest, healthiest thing to do, okay? We have more fire sign. And like I said earlier, somebody is going to show up with some flowers. I think you and this person, we have one, one, one. Whatever you're wishing that the outcome is, that's the outcome that you're gonna get. And that's beautiful, right? That's what you want. You want your wish to come true. It looks like you, you're surrounded by angels. This, your love life is protected regardless. 
Regardless, keep your eyes focused on what you want to be true. Your heart's desire is ready to come true. We have fire. It seems, let go of emotional upheaval, just like the Ten of Wands. It's like, I'm carrying this baggage. I'm just carrying a lot of emotions and we're burning it up. We're burning up. You might want to do a burning bowl ritual. Um, I'm offering healing and energy cleansing sessions. We can do cord cutting rituals. Just check out all the different things that I offer. You can book a time where we can do an energy cleansing together and a cord cutting ceremony to at least just clear the past and clear the energy and clear any blockages. And here we have the flowers. 1111, be generous. Success and emotional fulfillment are yours. So after we clear out this emotional baggage, we bring in emotional fulfillment and then you're overflowing enough to turn around, be this queen of wands and give, give, give to everybody. Shower your love on everybody that you choose to, that you want to, right? The choice is yours. The lovers, the original meaning of the lovers is the choice, okay? Okay. 